hi welcome back to my channel I'll be showing you how I'll be crocheting this baby booty I'll be using Bernard baby sport yarn now this um as I mentioned in one of previous videos um, if you are aware of the hurricanes that we just had recently, Hurricane Alma, it um, completely ravaged, ravaged my country and I lost my laptop. So I'm recording on my phone. So therefore my video can only be 15 minutes long. So um, when I reach to that 15 minute point, I'll have to end my video, but I'll have the um, instructions to the project in the description box so you can follow along to complete your booty it is a very easy pattern very simple so um, let's get started on that now for this um, booty we're gonna start with the chain let me focus in a little bit so you can see clearly we're gonna start with a chain of 12 Hope you can see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. These are the twelve chains. I hope it's focusing okay, if you can see. And now what we're gonna do we're gonna slip stitch in a second chain from the hook so we don't count the stitch that is on the hook we count one two we're gonna make a single crochet in that second chain from the hook and we're gonna we're going to make a single crochet in the next nine stitches. So I'm going to go, that's one of the nine. Two. Because I have limited time, I'll continue making the nine stitches and I'll come back and I'll show you the next step I've now um, reached the end of um, the making the nine single crochets and I have one more single crochet left so in that single one that last single crochet I'll put five single crochets in that space One, two, three, four, and five. And those five single crochet would allow a smooth turning so we can work on the opposite end of this pattern so in the other 10 stitches on the other side we're going to put one single crochet in each of the next 10 stitches on the opposite side so I'll meet you back when I've completed those 10 single crochets on the opposite side 
I've now completed um, the other 10 stitches on the opposite side. So what we're going to do next, we're going to slip stitch in our first single crochet. I'm going to make a slip stitch in the first single crochet. And that completes this first row of the booty. So the second row we're going to chain one. We're going to single crochet in that same space. In that same space. And we're going to put one single crochet in each of the next 10 single crochets. So we're going to make one single crochet in each of the next 10 single crochets along this side and I'll come back when I've completed those 10 single crochets okay I've completed those um, 10 single crochets and now at the corner where we made the, the five single crochet in the one stitch which will be around the toe area of the toe section of the booty. In each of those five single crochets, we're going to put two single crochet in each stitch. So I'm going to put my two stitches, sorry, my two single crochet in each of those five single crochets. And I'll come back when I've completed those five stitches put in two single crochet in each one and then I'll walk on the opposite side and come along to the edge and end it with a slip stitch in the first single crochet and I'll meet you back to continue on the third row okay I've now completed the other 10 single crochets and I've now reached to the end of this row so I have a marker and I'll make a slip stitch right in this stitch where I have my marker and this end will be the heel section of the booty so let, let me remove this marker and I'll slip stitch right in this stitch I'll make a slip stitch right in this stitch to end that row which is row number two so as you can see this is the toe area of the booty and this is the heel section of the booty so row number three we're gonna chain one we're gonna slip stitch right in the same stitch in the same stitch and we're gonna make a half double crochet in the next 10 single crochets so in the next 10 single crochets along this edge we're gonna make one double crochet oh, sorry one half double crochet and the half double crochet is your yarn over insert your hook pull up three loops yarn over pull through all the loops that's a half double crochet we're gonna do it once more you yarn over insert the hook pull up three strands on the three loops on the hook yarn over and you pull through all three so I'll continue making the other eight half double crochets and when I reach to the end, I'll come back to take you on to the next step. Okay, I've completed those 10 half double crochets. And now the 10 stitches around the two area where we put the um, two single crochet in each single crochet on the previous row. That becomes 10 stitches and in each of those stitches, 
we're gonna put one double crochet in each of those 10 stitches around the two area so I'll meet you back when I've completed those stitches okay I've completed the one double crochet in each of the 10 stitches around the two area so now to complete this row we're gonna put one do one double crochet in the remaining 10 single crochets on this row and we'll make a slip stitch in the beginning single crochet so I have my marker so I'm gonna complete those one double crochet sorry one half double crochet in the remaining 10 stitches and I'll meet you back when I've completed this row okay I've now reached to the end of um, row number three and this is what the booty is looking like so far it's now taking shape this is the again this is the toe area and behind here where we end up all our rows this is the heel the back of the heel so um as we continue on that was the end of row three now we're gonna begin row number four we're gonna chain one we're gonna slip stitch in the same stitch let me remove my marker i'm not ready for that and now in the the next 10 stitches we're gonna make one double crochet in each of the next 10 half double crochets so I'll make those 10 half double crochets and I'll come back and we'll continue on with the pattern I've now completed the 10 half double crochets so now we are working on the section now and in the first double this first double crochet of those 10 stitches around we're gonna put one one double crochet in each of the next three double crochets so we're gonna put one double crochet in each of the the next three double crochets one double crochet in each of the next three double crochets then we're going to put two double crochets in each of the next four double crochets we're going to put two double crochets in each of the next four there's two in this one two in that one two in that one and two in this one and we have three double crochets remaining we're going to put one double crochet in each of those three stitches and we're going to make our last ten half double crochet down the other side and then we're gonna join with a slip stitch so I'll complete those stitches and I'll complete row number four and come back and show you the next step okay we have now reached the end of row number four and see where we are at so for row number five my time is running out so I'm just gonna explain what I'll be doing the first 10 stitches from the heel we're gonna put one single crochet in each of these stitches the first 10 stitches and around the two area now where we have the 14 stitches we're gonna decrease every two double crochets so we're gonna decrease to make to decrease in each of the next two over each of the next two stitches so that will be seven times we're gonna decrease twice so we're gonna insert our hook and pull up and yarn over for every two of the double crochets around the two areas and to finish off we're gonna make a double crochet in the last ten stitches so that will be row number five I'll have the complete instructions in the description box below